beautiful live shot of Montreal. We are feeling these beats. We're grooving into a Friday. Did you know that today is make your own holiday day? So considering we can basically do what we want, I declare today National Breakfast Television Day. Let's go. Where we declare Woo! this show is the greatest thing ever. Helping us celebrate is DIY design expert and, and a man who's been too kind to us here with, with the threads, Christian Dare. Dare, Mr. Dare, how you doing? How, how dare you come up with pajamas with our faces on the back? You know like what? Nothing says, nice. nothing says humble pie. <laughs> like our names and heads on our backs. You right? know what I'm saying? There you go. Yeah, I, exactly. I, I will tell you this, Christian. You're the best. I love your pajamas, too. What does yours say on the oh, back? Oh, thanks. Mine says, love is but a dream. Aww. And, and they're very comfy. And I've got a banana in my name because I'm top banana over here. You are top um, banana. <laughs> and this is, a, this is an appealing segment. Hello. It's very appealing. Yeah. <laughs> so March 26 is apparently make up your own holiday day. So we thought, why not make it National Day of the Celebration of the Fabulosity of the Wonderlessness of Breakfast Television. Right? P.S. This so, isn't too far off because we launched this show across the nation just over a year ago. So oh, this is quite fitting own. and apropos. So, good and this timing. Is the good most timing. breathable pajama I have worn in ages. It this feels like butter. Really comfortable. Thank yeah. you. Really comfortable. So I have three ways that we should celebrate today. So the first thing is anytime you're throwing a party, you have to get dressed properly. So I don't know about you, but when I wake up in the morning, I watch breakfast television in my pajamas. <laughs> See? So I am giving you permission to wear your pajamas all day. <gasps> but I am not giving you permission to wear those saggy bum, threadbare crotch, <laughs> fong apart pajama pants. <laughs> You gotta toss those. Okay. You need to upgrade. This is a celebration. So I actually stopped by Winners and Marshalls and picked up some PJs for both of you. Love that. So they've got an amazing selection, even some fun slippers, like hello. Oh, I love um, those. But then, you know, because it's me, I had to DIY them. I had to upgrade them. So I reached out to this company called StickerU.com. It's Canadian. And they actually made me the BT patches that you guys are both wearing on the oh. front. And you can send them in faces of people and they will make custom vinyls that you can iron on the back. So that's why if you guys turn around for us, we've got Team Dina and Team Sid. See, so yeah, really? it's a great Canadian company. They'll sell it right to you from the internet so you can make your own custom pajamas. You just iron them on really, really easy. And they're great for washing too. Like these are secure. They're not gonna come off. Yeah, no, yeah. they're gonna come off, wash. And then I always say to throw a party, you need to have food, right? Yeah, 100%. It's all about the Hello? food. <laughs> I love that you gave us each a teeny tiny platter for one. <laughs> <laughs> right? So I thought, I've never made breakfast in my life, to be honest. Like, my kitchen doesn't even know I exist. I put <laughs> shoes in the oven to store them. But oh, I thought, no. I will make you guys breakfast. Anything for Sid and Dina. So the latest trend in breakfast is actually called a breakfast board. It's like a charcuterie board. And you fill it with your favorite breakfast food items. So I think it's perfect to, like, set out around 10, graze for brunch into lunch on breakfast television day. So everything you want from your waffles to your bacon to your hash browns, anything. And then I will admit, I kind so of cheated. When I was picking up stuff for the set the other week, I went by HomeSense. And you know they make pre-mixed mixes now? Yeah. Everything from muffins to scones to keto pancakes and waffles. Those are keto on your plate right there. So I got them at HomeSense Gourmet. Made my life easier. This I is can't a cook. waffly good idea. Mm. Very good. Right? And then I also thought... Because I grew up in La Belle Province, moi je mange la poutine, hein? So I made oui. you guys a breakfast poutine. Mm. So the trick to my breakfast poutines is called carbs on carbs. You do tater tots and french fries because mm -hmm. you need more carbs in your life, right? And for me, the perfect way to get at home crispy french fries is I hope you all have air fryers at oh home. Oh gosh, look at that. So I love this air fryer. It's from Ninja Foodie. It actually does two at once. So you can do your tater tots and your fries all at once, different temperatures, so you get perfect. Sid crispy. loves a good appliance, and he loves gifting mm. them to his wife, Lucy. <laughs> all right, Christian, time's not our friend. we got to hurry up. You got, you got drinks to wrap okay. this up? Drinks, of course. We have to celebrate, right? We have mm -hmm. to have a cocktail. So I made two cocktails. The first cocktail I'm calling the Grand Dina. Yeah. So it's for Dina because she's a Grand Dina. So it's actually like Aww. a French 75. It's actually, you can make it with oh, really oh, easy. Oh, One and a half oh, ounces oh. of Grand Marnier. Half an ounce, oh my God, of lemon juice, and then you top it up with champagne. The Grand Marnier just steps up the champagne. It's delicious. And then for you, Sid, I'm calling this one the Sidalicious. Okay. You know, like oh. delicious. Appropriate. So that's yes. what I think of when I think of you, right? So this guy's really easy. It's delicious. You actually just do one ounce of 40 Creek double barrel, half an ounce of Frangelico. You top it up with some cold brew coffee, which I made from this coffee maker. It does cold brew, which is amazing from Ninja. 
and then you just top it with a little bit. This is called Nanaimo Bar Cream. Mm. So it tastes like Nanaimo Bar, like bars, those Canadian things, right? So oh, wow. amazing cold brew coffee. It's delicious, guys. Cheers Kristen, to you. Cheers to cheers. National Breakfast Television Day. Thank you for celebrating in style like only you can. What, which one was the keto? Was it the waffle or was it the pancake? The waffle and the pancake. They're delicious. Did you know waffle and pancake mix are very similar? You just have to like sort of thin it down a little bit. I learned that. It's one thing I learned this week. We'll have our pancake oh. and eat it too. Christian, Cheers. this was great. Happy National Breakfast Television Day to you and yours. This is fantastic. Cheers. We love you, Cheers. Christian. Cheers. Salute. Where do we find more, Christian? Oh, you can follow me uh, on my Instagram. and Christian Dare, and I've got all these recipes on there, even how you make your own sit delicious. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, aptly named, Christian. Bless your heart. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right, we're going to sound off here coming up after the break. Again, 16 years ago this week, The Office debuted. It's one of the greatest sitcoms of all time. It got us thinking. What's your favorite TV sitcom ever? I'm talking the best one. Let us know. 1-866-267-3797. Feedback at breakfasttelevision.ca. And tweet at any time into the show at breakfasttv. Your reaction coming up a little later on. Good morning. You're watching Breakfast Television.